You know, there's been things said. Yeah. <laughs> They've been saying things like, I've heard this, now, women are not funny. And it's just like, man, have you never seen a woman fall down the stairs? That's just hilarious. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> You're like, ah, my cock sex! <laughs> 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 Sounds like cock, right? Hilarious. Uh, Set up, punchline. Fault line, it's all good. <laughs> so many funny things. I like to say comedy is like, it's like my mistress, you know? A huge waste of money. And that's <laughs> true. It's very true. I don't think I'm very funny in real life interactions because often I tell people I'm a comedian. And they say, oh, you're Canadian? <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? Is that Canadians are always saying ridiculous things that can possibly be true? That's them, right? And I'm like, you fucking hurt me. Um, <laughs> that's fun. Doing comedy is interesting. Like, I was at the comedy store. I thought I saw Joe Rogan. Turns out it was just a baked potato and a beanie. And <laughs> that was tough. <laughs> that was tough. You know, I just want a man to look at me the way that Joe Rogan looks at an MMA fighter with early theories about... <laughs> you know prehistoric man and mushrooms and speech development that would be lovely wouldn't it just that kind of rapt attention and bonerific energies i'd love it it's true it's true i have i am by day an archivist it's a grand title look for footage and uh mostly look at old films and it's just mostly it is mostly people doing the charleston and um <laughs> And Nazis, and Nazis doing the Charleston. It's just one video, but I watch it constantly, on a loop, and that's fun. It, uh, my boss told me, he's worked in TV for a while, he said the top four words that PBS noted got them the most views on an episode were lost, sharks, secrets, and Nazis. <laughs> Which is why this fall I'm coming out with a new show. Lost Secrets of the Nazi Sharks. <laughs> of course! How did they become Nazis? How many Hebrew head sharks did they kill? We don't know! We don't know! That's how those secrets got lost, right? They stayed secrets. Tell people things. That's how secrets get lost. Right? So silly. History's not hard to understand, really, is it? It's like in World War II. That's just a story of one people trying to overcome diversity. And uh, they lost it. A lot of comedians say they want to go back in time and kill Hitler, and I'm like, hey, buddy, don't meet your heroes. <laughs> right? <laughs> right? I have a lot of theories about history that people don't agree with, you know, a lot of radical things. Like I say, JFK shot first, and not a lot of, not a lot of people agree with that one. I think there was a lone gunman, and he acted entirely in self defense. <laughs> what could he do? What could he do? Do you guys know that the Pentagon is actually the world's largest Pentagon? <laughs> it's fucked up. It's fucked up. Think about it. But it's not about, people are divisive about race and history. It's not about black or white, right? It's all about green. Reptilians, they control everything. We know that. We know that. Watching a lot of ancient aliens lately. <laughs> Having a few theories about where this uh, giant pyramid come from. <laughs> Is the moon just a base? We don't know. <laughs> I've never been there. <laughs> right? They say to save water in California, you should pee in the shower. <laughs> I'm taking like five showers a day now. Who's this helping? <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't work. And then I was reading that uh, pineapple makes cum taste better. I eat pineapple all the time. This cum still tastes like shit. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't fucking get it. I'm glad nerds are getting served. Like Chris Hardwick. Fuck that guy. Fuck these nerds. I'm sick of how they brainwashed us all. Like, you know, it used to be like a fantasy world was like a cool thing. And then like people got obsessed with Harry Potter. Oh, your magical fantasy world involves going to school? What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh, what's, what house am I gonna be in? You know what house I wanted to be in? My house, smoking weed, you goddamn nerd. Shut up. And I loved Harry Potter. And I loved Harry Potter. Now I see through it. <laughs> Scheming single mom from the UK. She fooled us all. 
scheming lady. She's like, hey, I got him. Hey, I got him. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. I had something to follow up with that, and then I was just laughing at that dumb voice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Crawford, you done it again. <laughs> Got yourself distracted with your own vocal abilities. <laughs> you know, I was like, I was like 30 before I went to a doctor who was like, are you autistic? And, uh, no, no, she put it this way. She goes, have you ever been tested for autism? And I was like, oh, what? And then I went to another therapist, and she was like, you show a lot of signs of uh, autism. And I was like, what? And then I went to this other doctor, and he's like, you show a lot of signs of you're on the spectrum. I just couldn't pick up on what these people were saying, but uh, <laughs> trains are great, though, right? <laughs> Fucking the schedules, how they work. <laughs> I can't get enough of it. <laughs> Um, I do like dumb jokes. I do like silly jokes. I tell jokes so grown worthy, I tell them in bed. <laughs> jokes so corny, you're gonna pass them whole later. <laughs> I don't remember eating jokes. <laughs> Throwing it out there. <laughs> they call me the Michael Jordan of comedy. Because my dad was killed over my gambling debts. <laughs> and I do it with the flu and my tongue out. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Tell you what I don't like. Phone sex. That's a harsh transition. I'll go for it. <laughs> Throw it out there. Wanted to do some good jokes, and uh, this is one I like. Uh, I don't like it because I'm not very good at being verbal and sexual at the same time. And it was like, good dick, yeah, do it. <laughs> what? <laughs> like a cave woman doing the robot. <laughs> if you are ever nervous, this is a trick for my guitar teacher, if you are ever nervous before anything, particularly stage, screen, I don't know, red carpet event, that's hopeful for you people. Um, <laughs> have someone do the robot in front of you, because you cannot be nervous once you have seen someone be like, mur, 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 mur. Just, just clears your mind totally. It's like a mental enema. The, the robot. <laughs> Greatest dance of the 80s. I think in the future, robots are going to look back on that as blackface, though. <laughs> you know, once they take over, they'll be like, that was mean. <laughs> we don't do that. <laughs> you fucking humans. Um, I don't like phone sex, yeah, because the verbal part of it. I was doing it uh, with a famous comedian. <laughs> I say that because he would be famous to comedians, but not to people. And, uh, but not to, like, humans. And um, we were doing the phone sex because he was in another city, and he's like, ooh, why don't you put your fingers down your throat so it sounds like you're choking on my dick. <laughs> Graphic, right? <laughs> Graphic. And I was like, no. <laughs> I wanted to have phone sex, not become a sound effects director. Excuse me? Sound effects? What? I'm going to be like, oh, you're going to be so wet. Put my fingers in a bowl of oatmeal. Mix it up. You hear that? Oh, yeah. It's very old timey, isn't it? I'm going to be like, oh, you're banging me so hard, sailor. It's causing thunder and lightning. Conchunk, 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 shikashina metal. <laughs> Hurry up and come, War of the Worlds is on in two minutes! <laughs> yeah, da, 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 da. <laughs> I feel like that came full circle as I mentioned the Charleston, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, someone's smart, even on drugs. Um, <laughs> I told that thing. Guys, I'm gonna do this last joke, which is celebrity birthday news! <laughs> 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 Christopher Walken just turned 75. 75. It's amazing. 
Seems like just yesterday, he was a young man watching Natalie Wood get murdered on a boat. Oh. 75! 